Did you see the uh, the post that Jim Nagy, the senior bowl guy, wrote about you maybe being a, a fullback at the next level? Uh-uh. What did he say? Uh, he just said that, you know, that fullbacks are a dying breed, but that you could be kind of one of them. Like, what do you feel about that, maybe, as, as a future? Uh, That's an maybe? honor. You know, I love playing fullback. You know, if I have a chance at the next level, I feel like it'll be kind of at the fullback position just because of my build. Um, but for a guy to say something like that, you know, that's an honor. You don't see a lot of fullbacks now as much, but did you have a favorite guy growing up that you watched a little bit that, that played that position? Is it... uh, real early on for the Panthers, Brad Hoover, number 45. That was my guy growing up, coming from South Carolina. So, Brad Hoover. Yes, sir, Robert Gillespie called you a man's man. What's that mean to you? A man's man. You know, I just try to play the game with toughness, you know, and try to have a positive effect on the guys around me, lead by example. I guess that's what a man's man would mean. Did you always kind of have uh, a, that pride in blocking, or is that something that kind of you develop a little bit more as you kind of go into a role? I'd say I've always had kind of that pride in doing the dirty work. Uh, you know, I'm not a high school. I wasn't a big uh, stats guy. Um, that's kind of what got me to this level was, uh, you know, putting my hand down, you know, just doing the things other guys didn't want to. So. Uh, I look forward to doing that. You know, somebody's got to do it, and I'll be him. Was there a time, though, that you, like, I mean, obviously you're a D1 athlete, right? I mean, was there a time where you were racking up the stats? or No. I mean, every, <laughs> every, everybody pretty much here played quarterback in youth football. But, mm -hmm. um, you know, as soon as it got competitive, a tight end fullback was kind of my go-to. So. What sports did you play, too? Was it just always football? Or? I was actually a big swimmer. Growing okay. Up. For, like, 10 years, I did competitive swim. 50-yard uh, freestyle. That was my event. Does anything kind of like translate over? I mean, you yeah, uh, you know, you got lung capacity, stamina, um, you know, just building up that core strength, that back strength. It translates. So, have you ever campaigned for a, a handoff at that full way? Maybe in the goal line? Is there anything chalked up that we, we should keep an eye on? We had one in the playbook last year. Never got called. Uh, but we'll see. I might have to go up to Sheridan's office and kind of campaign for it. I'd love one, though. That'd be awesome. Yeah. Did it, Did y'all practice it much last year? Nah, nah, just a couple of times in practice, just in case. It, huh? wasn't, it wasn't that big of an event. Sorry. How good has it been for this team to have this bye week, the second bye week at this time, and kind of what, it, what practice has been like today and yesterday? It's been huge. You know, at this point in the season, everybody's kind of dealing with something. That's the nature of the sport. Um, but, you know, just as a rest standpoint, you know, kind of healing up and kind of refocusing on this last little leg of the season. Um, I think we had a really productive practice today. Got some pads popping, um, got a little bit of LSU work in. Um, I think we're on the right track. So looking forward to this next week. When you're pulling and coming around for a block and you see that guy, you have him, your target line lined up, what's the mindset heading into that? You, you know? know, honestly, there is no mindset. I just kind of black out. It just kind of <laughs> feels natural for me. So uh, I just kind of see target hit target. If you, if you weren't a tight end, what position do you think you'd play? Ooh. Probably center. Probably like a Jason Kelsey type if I couldn't play tight end. I didn't uh, – who had the – there was a team out there that had a center – I tied in do at center snap and had the you, you, did you see that uh -huh. Penn State yeah, yeah Penn State had the the, the tight, the end. tight end snap and then they threw to the, the center or something like that it was, oh that's cool yeah no, I didn't see that how do you this may sound dumb but like how do you develop a love for the block like how do you, like because you know nowadays a lot of people want the ball especially at, like tight ends like it was National Tight End Day a few mm -hmm. years ago like how do you develop a love for I want to hit this dude rather than score points uh, just going back to what I said earlier, you know, somebody's got to be that guy on any successful football team. You got to have a group of guys really that, that want to do the dirty work. Um, and I think it's the beautiful part of playing the sport that I play is, you know, you can legally like, you know, hit somebody as hard as you can. Um, so just kind of, you know, taking advantage of that and um, just willing to be that guy on the team that is going to open up some lanes for the ball carrier. You know, it's fun. Do you have a favorite block that you had where you just really lit someone up or that you remember from here? Nah, just GY counter. That's my favorite play. Do you remember when that switch flipped for you? Like, yeah, I'm, I'm going to be this guy. Mm, I've kind of always been that guy, you know. I'd say first day I put helmet and shoulder pads on. Just always love hitting people. Probably had to do that. I think number 45. I was actually 45, um, so like I said, my favorite fullback growing up, Brad Hoover, he was number 45, and I was number 45 going into high school. 
uh, but they didn't have number 45, so I was 81 for a little bit there. And then as soon as I could get my hands back on it, I grabbed it. Did, so. did they recruit you as an H-back fullback? Yeah. Okay, yeah. so yeah, so you were never just going to be only a tight end? Like yeah, you? I was always H-back okay. fullback. Didn't uh, in, in high school? Didn't you run some kind of like a triple option or something, or some kind of like um, run base? Pivot with? No, okay, um, I I did get a couple snaps at running back, but uh, no, we were kind of more of a spread okay. uh, type offense. Right. 